we will now hear a joint statement by the Cairo Institute for Human Rights Studies. Madam President, Algerian student Walid Nekish, arrested following his participation in a peaceful student march, declared in his trial this month that he had been subjected to physical, sexual and psychological abuse during his 14-month pretrial detention. The Council has remained largely silent in Algeria, despite UN special procedures expressing alarm at the extent of crackdown on dissent and highlighting that civil society organizations, human rights defenders and journalists are being increasingly scrutinized and harassed for carrying out their legitimate work. Legislation adopted last year in Algeria further infringes on fundamental rights and freedoms, and at least 13 media outlets have been made unavailable in 2020. The deteriorating human rights situation, including the weaponizing of the pandemic against civil society and the unrelenting criminalization of fundamental freedoms, warrants an urgent response from the Human Rights Council. In 2020, about 1,000 prosecutions were reported against individuals exercising the right to free expression and peaceful assembly, including 63 on charges of offense to the president. On the two-year anniversary of Algeria's Hirak pro-democracy movement, and as peaceful demonstration resumed throughout the country, our organizations reiterate calls to the Council to increase scrutiny on Algeria and closely monitor the situation in order to protect Algerians striving to safeguard their fundamental freedoms. We further urge the OHCHR and UN member states to call on authorities to unconditionally release arbitrarily held detainees and cease judicial harassment and intimidation. Thank you.